my crafters Raquel here with paints and glitter I'm coming along to share with you a collection of papers and dyes and that folder embossing folders from Phonic Studios they're in this box so this is a haul video and I'm just going to unbox all of this and the other thing that is in here is a mystery bag so I wanted to share my reaction with you guys because I don't know what's in the mystery bag, obviously, but this is the Candy Cane Collection from Tonic Studios. Super duper cute. And I'm just remembering that I think I ordered the tool collection because there are different options from Tonic Studios when they do mystery bags. So let's go through this first and I'm going to make sure that you can see this very well so okay so hopefully this is the best lighting i can get at this moment this is the candy cane christmas die set this has 46 dies super duper cute so these dies coordinate with the paper collection so i'm just going to share with you really quickly what you see here a collection of christmas trees there's this gingerbread boy that is so super cute he comes with a little hat there's an alternate little face here which i think is kind of neat and i think maybe that's for one of these pieces maybe you can make a little cookie or something like that but there are little ornaments here or baubles as you would call them in the uk and then there's this gorgeous stocking i look forward to using that the candy cane little buttons a bow the little candies like the peppermint there's a topper here for the ornament and down here there is a little snowflake and then some gift boxes with matching bows and some holly and berry super duper cute and as i said they do coordinate with the papers and there's also the new product from tonic studios which is the foil fusion adhesive sheets this has four sheets and they're a5 in size so you can add some foil to your papers here's a sample of one of those sheets and as you can see there you do have some different stockings so you can add these to the actual die cuts from this die set they will fit right in here so that's a really neat alternative there's also the pieces that will match the little christmas trees and that way you can cut out the background and then you use the foil and then there's a little portion here that will fit one of the ornaments that's this one down here and there are different sentiments such as joy to the world let it snow festive wishes and so you do get more than one as i said there's four in there so you can mix and match to your heart's content moving along there's a 36 sheet collection of papers and these are eight by eight let me open these up and i'll share what those look like so this eight inch collection of square cardstock is double-sided the first sheet here has the foiled little tags and there is a matching die set i don't have it right on hand but it will match the die set that you can get from tonic studios which is absolutely adorable it also comes with the little stamp dies so that way you can cut these pieces out and none of that will go to waste and then you do get the other pieces here that have of course the candy canes and on the other side there's a plaid this one's got the holly and berry and it also has little stars which i think is very unique then on the back there's a striped so you'll find that one side is a little more whimsical and the other side will be more traditional this one has the little trees but if you see the colors there you've got the pinks you've got the reds and then the greens and this kind of grayish brown then here this one says happy holidays and it has little candy canes that go all the way down red on pink the ornaments is super duper cute on the other side there's the green i'm sorry <laughs> on the other side there's the little snowflakes and these are all in different colors as well super pretty then over here on this paper are the little gingerbread men they're so adorable and then some of them have different colors hearts and then there's the little ginger girl and she's got a little bow super cute and then on the other side is the green plaid actually these are more like little diamonds i correct myself and then there are the little presents these are so pretty and i love that they have little tags one of the tags says for you the other one has a little heart and then on the other side is the red with the stars in different colors and here is the streamer of lights 
and there are die sets from Tyx Studios that have these little lights on them, so you may want to use that. And then there's this plaid here, very Christmassy. Here are the little stockings. And on the other side, this one says Season's Greetings, Noel, Sleigh, Peace, Ho Ho Ho, New Year, Joy to the World, Deck the Halls, Reindeer, Santa, Joy, Tinsel, Jingle Bells. So a bunch of different little words here that of course you would associate with Christmas time. There's a word angel, bobble, let's see here, silent night. So very, very cute. I like the combination of that. And then there's another one with the, oh my gosh, very, very vintage ornaments. We actually have some like that and that are about a hundred years old. So super cute. And then the polka dot on the back with the red on pink. And then these presents here are foiled. So you can see that there's quite a bit of papers in this collection. More little snowflakes, or I'm sorry, stars on that side. And then here are the larger traditional ornaments. And on the other side, the snowflakes. I love that these have the foil on there. If you see that, it catches the light. And then there's this really pretty green. And on the other side are more sentiments. Along with this collection, there's also the four sheets of the foiled toppers. So these are little strips that you can take and add them to the base of any card. There's also the pieces here that you can add to the inside or the outside of a little envelope and then little cut aparts. So if you're not familiar with this product, you can use these and create little tags or create card toppers, but I love that they've added the foil. This is so, so pretty. It's got that extra little bit of shimmer and then the sentiments such as joy to the world, festive wishes, candy cane wishes and mistletoe kisses and with lots of love. So of course you can use it during the Christmas time season to maybe create a little birthday card instead. But there are four sheets, they're all the same, super, super cute, or I'm sorry, they're not all the same because these two in the back are the ones that have those little adorable gingerbread men and then the trees, little ornaments, and then the toppers there for your envelopes. Along with this collection, there's also a set of six by eight stamps. This contains 14 stamps. And as you can see here, it's got all sorts of different sentiments that you can use for card making, for journaling, scrapbooking. And I love that it has the December 25th here. For instance, it's got even a happy new year, joy to the world, have a holly jolly Christmas, and then candy cane wishes and mistletoe kisses again here and don't forget that when you do stamping you don't have to use all of the words you can block off part of the stamp so that way if you just want to use for instance the word kisses you can do that if you want to use joy and just use that portion of the stamp and have a small one and then a larger one you can definitely do that very pretty and then here are the ones that are the stockings so this coordinates with the other dies and the foil sheets as well so again same sizes super super pretty i love how clean and crisp these little images are and the fact that it's got the little snowflake, which does look more like greenery uh, to me. So I think that's really cute. And then the little heart included along with the candy cane. So very, very pretty. So some of these stencils do coordinate with the size of the stamps. So you can definitely use some of them together or of course you can use them individually they will make a little gingerbread men they're also going to make the little christmas lights and candy canes the phrase happy holidays and then some little christmas trees also here's a, a quick little sample there of one of the little gingerbread men and then one of the sentiments and the lights so so cute and then there are 3d embossing folders which i'm super excited about that tonic studios has started to make because the results are absolutely great gorgeous and don't forget that you can use your foil on top of 3d embossing also then lastly here is the 18 sheets of 200 gsm card in the 12 by 12 size 
So to share with you what this looks like, it's going to be the same concept on the back of the cover sheet or the different tags that you can cut out using the dies from the collection, which I got with the timeless tidying. So the cool thing is that the same dies will match these tags as will all of the other collections that do have tag images on them. So that is super neat. And then here are some different candy cane colors and different candies then the plaid on the back here's the holly and ivy and then there's the little stars interspersed in there there's a stripe christmas trees the happy holidays on the back the traditional ornaments there with the snowflakes and some of these are kind of unique they don't they look like little bows instead of snowflakes which i think is kind of interesting and i wonder if they're a particular type of bow no just little bows it looks like and then the gorgeous little gingerbread men and, and there's the back little presents stars so the same images that you would have seen in the smaller collection of papers with the exception of the size of the images of course being larger to fit to the scale of 12 by 12 paper and also the lack of the foiling because this paper does not have that and then it just repeats itself of course with the pinks and the reds and that kind of a toppy or grayish brown is what i'm calling it i think it's super cute and i really like this paper with all of the little stockings i think that's super super cute and then i think maybe this repeated itself as well i'm pretty sure so very very pretty and perfect also for creating christmas bags or 3d projects because you can create more layers with the larger paper moving along with this order i picked up some mirror card because i thought it was so beautiful and this one is in the color silky sky and i thought it might look cute with some of these papers so that's going to be a guessing game. I'm not quite sure if I'll be able to use it with all of it, but it will, of course, coordinate really nicely with any 3D embossing or stamping that I may do. And so I thought that that would be a really nice color combination with some pinks. Now for the mystery bag, uh, what I received here are some Nuvo finger blenders. So these are excellent for the smaller inks and for the use of the, those stencils that I picked up. So I think those are going to come in handy. And another thing I'd like to do is take my label maker and actually put on here the color that is on the dauber. And I'll show you why, because when you put them back, you can easily forget which ink you had used because you're just going to end up covering it up with the previous dauber. But these come in very handy and I really like using them for smaller little images. And then you can just cut them out of the background. I also got in the mystery bag the paper piercer or retractable craft pick and you can never go wrong with having this in your tool essentials i use mine every time that i craft and i'm happy to have another one just in case and then lastly i did receive two of these a a4 size zip bags these are so much stronger than the alternative that's available out there i think everyone that crafts has seen them where you can readily get them online and I've gotten them myself but these are so much thicker and I love that I can definitely fit in here anything that I may want to craft with in fact I've been using them just like this for my collections and then that way I can even label the outside if I want to or if I just want to very quickly make some cards I can definitely just add the papers that I want to be using the dies everything that I want to craft with it's going to fit right inside and then I can put it on one of my shelves the zipper is not going to come undone and they're super super sturdy nothing's going to fall out and there's quite a lot of room in here I didn't put everything in there but you can tell outside of the 12 by 12 papers everything else will fit really nicely these do come in different sizes directly from tonic studios so I do recommend that you take a peek and right now a lot of the items 
that are on uh, clearance will include storage as well. So you may want to take a look at and see if any of these bags are on sale. I know that the craft pick is on sale and I'm pretty sure that the ink blenders are also. So that completes my Tonic Studios candy cane Christmas haul. Let me know what you think. I think the papers and even the mystery bag are super duper cool. And of course, I love that now I can put everything away really nice and tidy. Feel free to leave me a comment below. Don't forget that I also have links for you to shop with. And if you haven't yet subscribed to this channel, I invite you to do so. Don't forget that you can also share the videos on social media. I invite you to do so. Come back for future tutorials using this collection and more. And as I always say, I do hope that you can be inspired and be blessed. Thank you so much for watching.